Have you noticed when you're emotionally charged, you can't easily explain why, or at least not with any spe specificity. And you think of things like, oh, he's a jerk or she's a jerk, right? That's, that's your response. Just, I'm mad. I'm just so mad. Or maybe you're doing what I'm doing in this exact moment where you go, it's just, um, I can't. And you just can't find the word. So when you have those moments, I like to send you back to the seven choices. And you're probably going, what seven choices? So I'm Nancy Schick. I am the author of this book, DIY Conflict Resolution, and the founder of Third Ear Conflict Resolution. And in the book, we talk about seven choices that I coach my clients to make before they start engaging with people in a mediation setting usually. And the reason we go back to those seven choices is because you can see when you're emotionally charged, you don't make good choices, right? The actions that you take are not going to be from your best set of state of mind. And therefore you're probably not gonna act your best. Do you want to think about a situation that occurred recently, very publicly? Look at what happened at the Oscars this year, right? So imagine if Will Smith had been able to state with particularity what was going on with him and then took action, right? And so what I, I like to have people do in that first action. So now we move from the from the seven choices to the five actions. That first action is all about defining the conflict succinctly. So imagine if Will Smith just stepped back and said, I disagree with Chris Rock about whether this joke is funny. And then he just stopped and said, oh, that's really all it's about. And then we start to get in to the interest behind that that drove him to take the action. I'll be talking about that in future videos because we're going to go through those five actions. But what I want you to start thinking about now are some of the conflicts in your life and whether you can just look at specifically what you disagree with the other person about. And sometimes it's a whole list of things, right? But start there. If you're interested in getting the book, I'll put a link in the notes to the video. I did mention that I am going to be going through all five of those choices. So we're going to go step by step in the actions that we take in a mediation process. But you're going to be able to do this at home and start building the life that you want. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button below. And in the meantime, keep listening with your third ear for those hurts you can heal.